Hi friends, you know that the time period of an oscillating simple pendulum is given by the formula t is equal to 2 pi square root of l by g, where l is the effective length of the pendulum and g is the acceleration due to gravity at the place. Now let us go for a numerical problem. Here it is. What is the time period of a simple pendulum of length 1 meter on the earth? Time period t is equal to 2 pi square root of l by g. Substituting the given values we get t is equal to 2 into 3.14 into square root of 1 by 9.8. That comes to be 2.01 second which is approximately equal to 2 second. You know that a pendulum of time period 2 second is called seconds pendulum. Thus, length of a seconds pendulum on the earth is 1 meter. What will be the time period of a simple pendulum of length 1 meter on the moon? Is it 2 second itself? No. You know acceleration due to gravity on the moon is only 1.6 meter per second square. Well, let us calculate the time period of a simple pendulum of length 1 meter on the moon. We have t is equal to 2 pi square root of l by g. That's equal to 2 into 3.14 into square root of 1 by 1.6. That comes to be 4.98 second which is approximately equal to 5 second. As we've already seen, a pendulum with a time period 2 second is called seconds pendulum. What is the length of a seconds pendulum on the moon? Let's find. We have the formula t is equal to 2 pi square root of l by g which can be written like 2 pi square root of l by g is equal to t. Squaring both sides of the equation, we get 4 pi square into l by g is equal to t squared. On rearranging, we get length of the pendulum L is equal to t square g divided by 4 pi square. On substituting the values, we get 2 squared into 1.6 divided by 4 into 3.14 squared, which is equal to 0 0.16 meter. Thank you.